Dear congregation, today we gather to explore the signs of divine elevation, those unmistakable moments when God is preparing to elevate us to new levels in life. These signs may manifest in various ways, but they all point to God's sovereign hand at work in our lives, guiding us toward greater blessings and purpose. Let us delve into the scriptures to discern these signs and prepare our hearts for the journey ahead. Divine Favor Esther 2.17 In the twelfth month, that is, the month Adar on the thirteenth day thereof, when the king's commandment and his decree drew near to be put in execution, in the day that the enemies of the Jews hoped to have power over them, though it was turned to the contrary, that the Jews had rule over them that hated them. Divine favor often comes unexpectedly, turning situations around in our favor despite the odds, just as Esther found favor with the king, we too may experience divine favor that opens doors and shifts circumstances in our lives. Supernatural Provision, Philippians 4.19 But my God shall supply all your need according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. When God is preparing to elevate us, he provides supernaturally for our needs, ensuring that we lack nothing as we step into the new season he has ordained for us. Divine Alignment, Proverbs 3, 5, 6. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy paths. Explanation. Divine elevation often involves divine alignment, where God directs our steps and orchestrates circumstances according to his perfect will, leading us on the path he has prepared for us. Inner Transformation. Romans 12, 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. As God prepares to elevate us, He works within us, transforming our hearts and minds to align with His purposes and desires, enabling us to discern His will and walk in obedience. Unwavering Peace, Isaiah 26, 3. Thou wilt keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on thee, because he trusteth in thee. Divine elevation is often accompanied by a deep sense of peace, even in the midst of uncertainty or challenges, as we trust in God's faithfulness and sovereignty over our lives. Confirmation through others. Proverbs 11:14, Where no counsel is, the people fall. But in the multitude of counselors there is safety. God may confirm his plans for our elevation through wise counsel and affirmation from others in our lives, providing clarity and assurance as we step forward in faith. Persistent Doors, Revelation 3, 8 I know thy works. Behold, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it. For thou hast a little strength, and hast kept my word, and hast not denied my name. God opens doors of opportunity that align with His purposes for our lives, and these doors remain open despite challenges or opposition signifying His divine hand at work in our elevation. Uncommon Opportunities Ecclesiastes 9.11 I returned and saw under the sun that the race is not to the swift nor the battle to the strong, neither yet bread to the wise nor yet riches to men of understanding, nor yet favor to men of skill. But time and chance happeneth to them all. In moments of divine elevation, God presents us with uncommon opportunities that defy human logic and expectations. These opportunities may come unexpectedly, but they bear the mark of God's hand orchestrating events for our advancement. Supernatural Endurance, Isaiah 40, 31. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength, they shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Explanation Divine elevation requires supernatural endurance, which God graciously provides to those who wait upon Him. Even in times of weariness or challenge, God's strength sustains us, enabling us to press on toward the fulfillment of His purposes. Overflowing Joy, Psalm 16:11. Thou wilt show me the path of life. In thy presence is fullness of joy. At thy right hand there are pleasures forevermore. Explanation 
As we walk in alignment with God's plan for our lives, we experience overflowing joy that surpasses circumstances and fills our hearts with gladness. This joy is a tangible sign of God's presence and favor, leading us toward greater fulfillment and contentment in Him. Divine Encounters, Genesis 28, 16. And Jacob awaked out of his sleep, and he said, Surely the Lord is in this place, and I knew it not. Explanation God often reveals Himself to us through divine encounters, awakening our awareness to His presence and purpose in our lives. These encounters serve as powerful reminders of God's nearness and His active involvement in our journey of elevation. Spiritual Discernment, 1 Corinthians 2, 12, 14. Now we have received, not the spirit of the world, but the spirit which is of God, that we might know the things that are freely given to us of God which things also we speak, not in the words which man's wisdom teacheth, but which the Holy Ghost teacheth, comparing spiritual things with spiritual. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of God, for they are foolishness unto him, neither can he know them, because they are spiritually discerned. Through the Holy Spirit, God grants us spiritual discernment to recognize the signs of divine elevation and to discern His leading in our lives. As we cultivate a sensitive spirit and align ourselves with God's Word, we gain clarity and insight into His divine plans and purposes for us. Uncommon Opportunities Ecclesiastes 9.11 I returned and saw under the sun that the race is not to the swift, nor the battle to the strong, neither yet bread to the wise, nor yet riches to men of understanding, nor yet favor to men of skill. But time and chance happeneth to them all. In the journey of life, God often presents us with uncommon opportunities that transcend human understanding. These opportunities, though seemingly random, are orchestrated by God's providence to propel us forward in His divine plan. Supernatural Endurance Isaiah 40, 31 But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength, they shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Divine elevation requires supernatural endurance, which is replenished by our dependence on the Lord. As we patiently wait on Him, He infuses us with the strength to persevere through challenges and soar to new heights in our journey of faith. Overflowing Joy Psalm 1611 Thou wilt show me the path of life. In thy presence is fullness of joy. At thy right hand there are pleasures forevermore. In God's presence there is an abundance of joy that transcends circumstances and fills our hearts with contentment. As we draw near to Him, He lavishes us with His joy, granting us the resilience to navigate life's challenges with a spirit of rejoicing. Divine Encounters Genesis 28, 16 and Jacob awaked out of his sleep, and he said, Surely the Lord is in this place, and I knew it not. Throughout Scripture and in our lives, God orchestrates divine encounters that awaken us to his presence and purpose. These encounters serve as poignant reminders that God is intimately involved in every aspect of our lives, guiding us toward divine elevation. Spiritual Discernment 1 Corinthians 2:12-14. Now we have received not the spirit of the world, but the spirit which is of God, that we might know the things that are freely given to us of God, which things also we speak, not in the words which man's wisdom teacheth, but which the Holy Ghost teacheth, comparing spiritual things with spiritual. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of God, for they are foolishness unto him, neither can he know them, because they are spiritually discerned. Through the Holy Spirit, God grants us spiritual discernment to recognize His leading and discern His divine plan for our lives. As we cultivate a sensitive spirit and align ourselves with God's Word, He imparts wisdom and insight, guiding us on the path of divine elevation. As we reflect on these signs of divine elevation, let us remain attuned to God's leading in our lives, whether through uncommon opportunities supernatural endurance, overflowing joy, divine encounters, or spiritual discernment, 
God continually reveals himself to his children, guiding them toward the fulfillment of his divine purposes. Let us therefore walk in faith and expectation, trusting in God's faithfulness to lead us into abundant life and divine elevation. Amen.